In an effort to stop the spread of leaks coming out of the White House, President Donald Trump reportedly asked his senior staff to sign non-disclosure agreements. That's according to a columnist from the Washington Post, who claims to have seen a draft of the agreement, but not a final copy. Language in the draft copy reportedly ordered staffers to pay $10 million to the federal government for each piece of confidential information they shared. The Post noted that penalty was most likely smaller in the final agreement, since sources the writer talked to did not remember that number. Members of Trump's campaign and transition teams reportedly signed NDAs, but the agreement White House staffers signed reportedly extends beyond Trump's time in the Oval Office. Staffers ultimately signed the agreements because they reportedly concluded they're likely not enforceable. The White House has yet to comment on the report.